At first, man was like better than an animal. As reason developed in him, he began to make discovering and inventions to make life more and more comfortable. It is science that is at the root of this progress. Let us first take the case of food, the most essential of all things. Primitive people did not know how to grow food. Gradually, people learned to cultivate lands with the plug drawn by balogs. But science has been teaching them how to produce more and better crops at a leisure level with the help of tractors and fertilizers and high yielding varieties of seeds. Scientists are trying to grow food even in deserts. They have discovered various substitute foods. The population of the world has been increasing steadily and but for these achievements there would have been chronic famines in many places. Science has made home life comfortable and enjoyable. The electric light and fan, the electric cooker, the refrigerator etc. have freed life of much of the drudgery and discomfort our forefathers had to go through. In the rich countries of the West, there are many other labor saving gadgets, small machinery in almost every house. Science has given us improved methods of transport and communication. Formerly, there were only below cars and boats. Now, we have railways, steamships, motor cars, aeroplanes, etc. These have enabled us to travel even to the farthest end of the world within a very short time in comfort and safety. Science has given us the printed book which is our main source of knowledge. The telegraph, the telephone, the radio and TV have made communication quick and safe. The latest edition in this list in computer. It has changed the world. Science has also greatly helped the improvement of health. We have now good medicines for many diseases which were so fatal only a few years back. Modern surgery also has been doing wonders in the surgical field. Scientists have succeeded in sending up artificial satellites and have already landed on moon. Expect to reach Mars within a short time. All these are wonders of science and we do not know what further wonders will be achieved by it in future. But it is deeply regretted that the power of science is being used for evil purposes also. We all know how books are used for propaganda purposes. What damage and destruction were caused by aeroplanes in Europe and how whole cities were wiped out by atom bombs in Japan during the last world war. We also know what a mad race is going on for the production of deadlier weapons for destruction. This is certainly deplorable but that is the abuse of science. And because a good thing is abused, the thing itself is not to blame. In fact, there is not good thing that cannot be abused. We should use science only for the good of the mankind.